This is calculator question number 16 from practice test 1. College Board gives us a graph relating the cost of renting a boat, the number of hours rented where our horizontal axis H is number of hours, vertical axis C is total cost in dollars. And they ask which of the following represents the relationship between H and C? And we have four linear equations for this linear graph. I first noticed that the vertical inter intercept, the C intercept, is 5. Choices A and D have an intercept of 0, so they're incorrect. It's either B or C. The question is, what is the slope? And it's tempting to count squares. I go up 3 squares and write 4 squares, so the slope change in y over change in x looks like 3 over 4, and many people will choose C. But keep in mind that College Board often labels the graphs with different scales on vertical and horizontal. And in fact, in this case, they have done that. Going from this point, h equals 0, to this point with h equals 1, my change in c is 3, my change in x in h is 1. So my slope is the change in C over the change in H is 3, not 3 fourths. The correct answer is C. Always read the scales on your horizontal and vertical axes, both on the SAT and in the real world. Those often do not match, and it's important to label them and read them carefully. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.